time. Now they got to get the left handers doing it. Yeah, the first pitch ball from Mitch White. The Tini is coming back. They're both going to reclaim spots in the rotation. That is one thing the Dodgers have gone into the post and who we're going to see on Thursday in the day game has been phenomenal this year. High in the air toward the infield just beyond the infield and there's out number one. White on for his fourth start. It's like they mass produce pitch you can see those three pitches are basically his arsenal. Crack to center field. Bellinger makes a catch for out number two on Andrew Vaughn. Become essentially a defensive specialist yeah, very in much some so. ways. And ball one to Luis Robert. It was Misty even. Misty even. They were playing Misty on you. Thanks. <laughs> we're hailing you. You see, it's a play on words. Oh, I see. See, what we're doing. That's terrific. Yeah. Yeah. Sticky stuff, and then. Missed the plate by 15 feet. Oh, that was all a bit. You're oh, saying. it was the whole thing was a bit. Yeah. yeah. I mean, oh, there it is. Yes, it was my glove. In your haste, you discarded it unceremoniously. <laughs> Put on your headset. Hey, it served this first. We'll have to look at this slider. That was a good slider, and that was and up nine down to this point of the ball game in the series opener against one of the best teams in baseball and one of the best teams. A healthy Degrom and a healthy Scherzer. It's pretty frightening what that team can become. Would they ever lose? Close. Yeah, it's uh, especially with you know Atlanta starting slowly. The Marlins have a team race. Well, eventually Tatis comes back to San Diego. No go, says Jerry Meals at first. Blake Snell's been out too. Yeah, but it's San Francisco that would have some trouble, I think, keeping up. And the only thing that trend the, the Giants are hoping that does not continue. On the ground, Gavin Lux throws out a Brayu. One down for Gavin Sheets, who takes a curveball just low, 1 0. Moncada and Gavin, along with Yasmani. The three of them. Left side, 1 and 2 on Gavin. That second round, like Ben Rortbet. Bo Bichette was right behind him. Left side of the infield for out number two. Here's it really wasn't easy to get here, and now they're trying to stay here. I mean, two Achilles tendon rupture, and Jake was able to come back and come out the other end. I mean, we've talked to him himself deeply to his body and to come back to play this sport that he loves so much. Jake's sister, Ellie, who's been named the head coach at Missouri State, Jake's alma mater, and her alma mater as well, to become the uh, new. And you open up your presents, and you rip through them, and they <laughs> give you a pair of socks. And you're no, free no, no. of these pieces. No, here's the thing about this. <laughs> yes. We, you know, we share the food typically, but because this is your day, I decided. No. I hope there's a lot of cheese on here. <laughs> Cilantro and paprika. No, this is good. This is really good. So, <laughs> away so he can keep score. <laughs> but I kind of love the idea of you juggling corn for us in the third inning. I yeah, <laughs> this is really good. Uh, we're going to put it. <laughs> this is really good. I had no idea where to put it. No, I, I can tell you where to put it. I got to tell you that. Wow. <laughs> Did they spray it with something? If, yeah, uh, avocado aioli. That was your gift. Oh, it was quite a gift. From me yeah. to you. A barrel full of elotes. <laughs> Freeman over. It matched your socks today. Yeah. You have your well, yellow socks. You know what these socks represent, don't you? Oh, my goodness. You were in Lucas's no hitter. And McGuire pumps this ball to center. It's Bellinger. Two down. Continue second time through. He's only given up the one base runner. Meantime, Mitch White hasn't allowed a base runner yet. But guaranteed rate field, which uh, evidently has post-game DJs after every Saturday game. It's good to know. Will you be DJing? Regifting Elotes. I like that a and lot. Good band name. Change up call to strike on Harrison. Because he brought it back up, and it appeared to be down because it was down. Second base. Nine up, nine down for Mitch White. We're scoreless. Um, 
Well, congratulations on the 40 years you still wear. And I see on occasion during the off season too. Um, I would, I would, uh, it's time. Um, great actress. Um, I hope, I hope there's another 40 in your future. The greatest thing I ever heard about Bob <laughs> Euchre. Well, I will tell you. It's a ground ball to short. Yeah. Greatest thing I ever heard in a description of Bob things like he did, but what an amazing career he's had. Had his own TV series. How about a guy having Mr. Belvedere? Mr. Belvedere. The circuit every once and again. That he, he went up to the booth. He had done a commercial with Bob Euchre. And so he went up to the booth with him and <laughs> Creed's Clearwater Revival. And Euchre, as, as Norm told the story, he goes, You want, I can go down to a concert for me, but thank you, Bob. He, you're right, he knows everybody. Yeah. I was. I was listening to him on a game, United States Army tank. Go down there and get it. Sure, it's you know it's a little hard on the gas, but other than I thought honestly we were going to get to your 41st year before Bob's message was over. <laughs> to third, Turner. Four perfect innings. Well, I don't and Jake Berger as the Sox try to solve Mitch White, who's gone 12 up and 12 down. You mean the 20 that this year? That was that was really nice. I had a good time, and I thought. Kevin Euclid was terrific. I think, I think he's going to be very Jerry Remy, who is a legend there and always will be. Abreu up the middle, off the mound, and that helped. It's a base hit, and it's the first White Sox hit and base runner. We'll go to the studio, see what's coming up on Subaru White Sox post game live. Scott Pitt said, Nick. Well, thank you. And right now, he's got him eating out of his hand. It was a very good stop, by the way. 1-1. One, one. On the ground, second base. Lux does spin it to second. He gets the out there and takes the lead runner. One gone. Inside ball, one to Berger. You know, of the defense. Ooh, that caught Berger. That got him on the elbow, I think. Two on. Moncada takes a strike. Punch through the left side because they're playing him as a pull hitter. One and one to Yuan. Into center field on a line. Bellinger's up with it and a stop sign at third for Gavin Sheets. So the bases are loaded with one out for McGuire, who stung the ball to center his first time. That was one of the hardest his ball. One and oh to McGuire. Half swing foul and a laser that one and one to McGuire. Popped up foul, third base side, one and two. One and two from White. McGuire takes well, a curveball in the dirt, two and two. You have two and two. McGuire takes a slider buried three and two on Reese. One team if he makes it through this one. Three two. He took strike three. Fastball up right at Lux. Two out. Harrison takes a cold strike. Corner. One two on Harrison. Chopper to third. Turner watches it go foul. It's being <laughs> reviewed currently. 0-2. Swing and a miss. Another slider. And a white.